and then, ah, shoot, it's not even on. All the hair salons were closed, therefore I thought it would be a great idea to buy my own hair clippers. So this is one that I found. So I'm gonna cut my hair, and I just realized that the tutorial I was looking at is for a undercut fade, which I'm not really sure is what I wanna do with my hair. I don't exactly have the biggest head, so if I shave everything, I may end up looking like I have the tiniest head in the world. So I don't think I'm gonna cut my hair in the exact same way in this tutorial, but hopefully I can take pointers from parts of the tutorial. And one of the biggest takeaways from Jensen's video is be confident. So I'm gonna be confident that I know what I'm doing and hopefully it all works out. Apparently I need comb, razor, and scissors, which are our standard utility scissors. So let's see how this goes. He says to wet hair first, so I'm gonna do that. So this is wet hair. Okay. Thanks Marco for this jacket. This material is kind of like the material of the hairdresser. Next up, shave. Does this count as part of the haircut? I feel like I'm really just gonna worry about this overflowing ear part. And then the back. I just don't know if I should be following this tutorial completely. So you're stuck at home and your hair is getting a bit too long, but you're not seeing a barber anytime soon. Well, today I'm going to teach you how to give yourself an undercut from the comfort of your own home step by step. Who says you can't get Literally a fresh just fade gonna follow. under lockdown? In an upwards direction and pulling out, right? Up and then, ah, shoot, it's not even on. Okay, practice up and out, up and out. But the way he's doing it looks really aggressive, so it's kind of scary. Wait, which way is the down? Oh, okay. All right, I'm gonna pause the video there. What can go wrong? I'm going on the 16, is he even gonna get any of my hair? 16 millimeters? Find the part, Lord help. Up and out. Okay. Okay, it's not too bad yet. Up and out. Up and out. Up and out. Dude, that's not too bad! <laughs> I'm pretty happy with that so far. I mean, still very premature, but not bad, not bad, not bad. All right, first part is do this bit successfully, which I feel like for the time being, I'll leave it there. Now I just gotta do this side. Okay, same with this side, I gotta figure out where the top part of my head separates from this side. I mean, after the first set, I feel a lot more confident coming into this side of my head. There's a tiny part of me that feels like am I being too reserved with this, but I'd rather cut less of my hair off first and then go shorter after if I need to. I don't even know if my hair has a part there but I'm gonna make one and just trust that that looks all right. <laughs> and so far, I'm not too sad about this. I'm just kinda impressed. All right, I'm just gonna review a video just to see what happens after you do the sides. Okay, that's 
use a mirror. So I'm kind of confident with the guard that it's not going to cut shorter. But I can kind of go blind. Just feel it out. I go all the way up and do that ruler trick. Nothing can stop me. I'm all the way up. All the way up. I'm getting into the flow of this now. Can I just leave the top? Cut the top of that. If my goal is just to clean the sides up, I feel like my job is done. See what else he does. Could be killing the back of my head right now. It's gonna help you set up your hair. Once you've gone that down, we'll be cutting the bangs, the hair that grows right above the forehead. And we're gonna cut it to the middle of the forehead. In this method, you're gonna be able to cut your hair non-uniformly. It's gonna be kind of random and messy, and that's on purpose because it makes a natural cut. Once that, just cut a little bit, put it down, see where it lays, cut a little bit, do it again, do it again. And what's gonna happen is that eventually you're gonna get it to a position where it matches the length of the bang, and it's gonna have this diagonal slant that connects with your bangs. Midway progress ish. This is pretty much how my hair is gonna look. I don't spike it. What's the back look like? Okay, back needs clean up. I'm okay with this. Definitely could do some cleaning up at the back. All right, risking it. Let's go one shorter. What's the next one? 12. Went from 16, now we go for 12. Let's try this. Very happy with this purchase. I didn't cut too much off the back. <laughs> hmm. 
make the neck look long and then cut more of the top here. I'm just using the back of my hand as a guide to how high I should be going. I just hope my hand is straight. That was a mistake for sure. Oh my gosh. Oh, please don't be a mistake. It's okay. It was the worst. All right, I'm just gonna trust it. Be fine, be fine. So, so far, it's not actually as disastrous as I thought it would be. There's a tiny part of myself that's actually a little bit proud. <laughs> We'll see after a shower. Okay, showered. Now I just need to wax it. Quick turnaround preview. Real verdict is if Rihanna approves. Babe, are you still playing? No. Alright, ready? Ready? Oh, nice! <laughs> really? Yeah! How's the back? I mean, I'm sure there's probably areas that I need to fix. Oh, actually, it's just the wax. But, like, it's like a random like, strand. Like, hair get kind of. Like as in that's just poofing out a little bit, but it's nice. But that's what I mean, it's kind of like, could I have uh, shaved that poofy bit off, or? <laughs> it's nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's good. Out of 10. Would you, would you have, if I told you I went for a haircut and this is what I got, would you believe it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. QB okay. House. But to be fair. QB <laughs> House qualified. <laughs> to be fair, I... I actually like your hair like this. Like you should probably see if they can do. I don't know. Like I feel like when you've gotten a haircut before, yeah. they end up cutting too short. Yeah. So you look like a little fish. Okay, I Out give of 10. it. Okay, I give it actually like a high score, like an eight out of ten. Ooh. I was yes. say ten out of ten because this. I know this is your first time actually really doing this. There's definitely things to improve. Like what? But I feel like you should ask, you should send this and ask um, like Yuki or somebody. What do you guys think? <laughs> I would be curious if we, there's somebody who's a hairdresser, like a trained professional hairdresser. What do you think? And with glasses. Cool. I think that's it for this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video.